this is what I came for. A lovely red pin of around 30 to 33 centimetres. He swallowed that jig head, but I was able to get it out. I'll explain the jig head in a second. Just have a look at that. What a beautiful fish. Did you get a good look? Absolutely fantastic. I love these things. Look at that. That is a TT Lures rev head. It is one eighth of an ounce. It's a little jig head with a blade on it like a spinner bait. And that's a Z-Man soft plastic. Z-Man have a motto. Ten times tough. Sounds a bit like me really. The only thing tougher than that plastic is Chuck Norris. But I bet he's not as fast as the tail on that plastic as it moves through the water. Let's see if I can catch another one. But these Z-Man soft plastics and the TT rev head jig heads, what a great combination. And right now I'd like to give my good friend Justin Wilmer a plug. There you go mate, should fit perfectly in your sink. A little white plug by Karoma. <laughs> oh, well, there's your free plug, it's all you're getting. <laughs> well the fishing's been very slow. I've caught one, I've lost one. Time to change. What to do, what to do. Oh dear, having too much fun. I've only caught one fish, but I'm having too much fun. Don't tell the fun police. I don't want them knowing. Because they get jealous when I go fishing. When the fish get scared, the fun police get jealous. And my wife tells me I go fishing too often. <laughs> it's been bloody quiet. Can the little Z-Man paddle tail deliver the goods for me today? Let's pray, shall we? What a trophy of a fish! That red fin would have to be close to 40 centimetres long. Look at that red fin. What an absolute cracker of a fish. Absolutely fantastic. Had quite a few strikes. This is another big fish. Oh, bugger! What a cracker of a fish! I'm estimating that fish to be around the 40 centimetre size. It was a tank. It was pulling line off my drag. But then he looked at me and said, why should I be on camera with that ugly fella? He hadn't had a shave today. So there's a tip. Have a shave before you go fishing. The fish might uh, feel a bit more comfortable being acquainted with you. Because that one might have nothing to do with me. Which was a shame because it was a huge fish.
A little bit of a tight squeeze. This is where I went wrong last week, but I haven't got much choice. <laughs> I don't like lifting them up the bank like that after last week. <laughs> Look at that. A nice, another nice red fin on the Z-Man. Lovely fish, probably around 27 to 29 centimetres maybe. Not as big as that big one I just lost back there, but still a nice fish. And a lot of fun. Having a cracker of a day. That fish has got to be close to 37 or 38 centimetres long. He's uh, taken the little TT Lures rev head. See the little propeller little blade on it? They are fantastic invention. And is also hooked on the Z-Man two and a half inch curl tail grub. But have a look at this. Look at that fish. I think a big cormorant might have gone for that. I decided to put the little uh, rev head back on. On the very first cast, I've hooked a fish that's beautiful on one side, damaged on the other. Unbelievable. It's amazing what goes on in nature. Have a look at that, hey, what a cracker, lovely redfin, around about 37, 38 centimetres, once again caught on the little rev head, little TT Lewis rev head, with the Z-Man soft plastic, what a beauty. I'll tell you what, this little NS Hurricane rod, I absolutely love it. It's taken my fishing to a new level. I'm just addicted to using this rod. And I'm addicted to catching these fish. And I'm addicted to these TT lures, uh, rev heads at the moment. Just fantastic. This one's not swimming very far. I caught that nice red fin on that rev head and then I lost it on a snag. That rev head is gone. It's gone. It's gone. It's gone. Gone far, far away. The traveling Wilburys. Oh, it's gone. It's on that log to stay. It's gone, gone, gone. It's gone, 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 gone. Wah! Have a look at that fish. You can see he's engulfed the little TT Lewis blade. What an absolute stonker. 
I might have to get my tape measure out and measure this one because I reckon he is 40 centimetres, if not a little bit bigger. What an absolute cracker. And look at the scars on him. He's got scars on his side. And he's got scars on that side. I'm starting to think there might be bears around here. That's the second one with all the damage. Unbelievable. Just in case you missed it, have a look. Woohoo! <laughs> loving it. Absolutely loving it. <laughs> I'm about to head home. I'd like to thank you all for watching my video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you've had as much fun watching it as what I have making it. I've loved fishing all my life. I'm not about to stop. I'm loving it more than ever. And I'm loving it now that I'm able to share my enjoyment with other people. I've probably come across as being a bit hypo, a bit over the top. Damn, I've heard it all before. <laughs> and it's never bothered me before. And it's not about to start. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Hopefully you'll keep watching. Hopefully you'll get a bit of bit of entertainment out of it and uh, learn a trick or two and uh, hopefully you can share my passion for the great outdoors. Thank you very much. <laughs>